Hey guys, for this video, we are going to discuss to you what is Fortran or Formula Translation all about. So if you want to know what is this language, just keep on watching. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Hi guys, before we talk about what is Fortran, let me introduce myself. My name is Jerry Kaoba, grade 11 student. <laughs> Fortran was created by John Bacchus at IBM in 1957. Consider the oldest languages, high level languages created for scientific, mathematical, and business computing. Okay, so before I start, I would like to introduce myself first. I am Janvi Moraldi, currently studying at Consuelo National High School. So, let me discuss to you that Fortran language. So, the names of earlier versions of language through Fortran 77 were conventionally spelled. All capitals Fortran 77 was the last version in which the use of the lowercase letters and keywords was strictly non-standard. Okay, so the capitalization has been dropped and referring to newer versions beginning with Fortran 90. The official language standards now refer to the language as Fortran rather than all capitals for Okay, so for the overview, Fortran is derived from Formula Translating System. It's a general purpose imperative programming language. It is used to for numeric and scientific computing. Fortran was originally developed by IBM in the 1950s for scientific and engineering applications. Fortran ruled this programming area for a long time and because very popular for high performance computing because it supports so now i will be the one who will discuss to you the history of Fortran. so by the way i'm grace on jane b Ranghel, a grade 11 student studying at consuelo national high school in late 1953 jan bacco submitted a proposal to his superiors at ibm to develop a more practical alternative to assembly language for programming to IBM 704 main th mainframe computer. I said, in late 1953, John Bacchus submitted a proposal to his superiors at IBM to develop a more practical alternative to assembly language for programming their IBM 704 mainframe computer. Bacchus' historic Fortran team consisted of programmers Richard Goldberg, Sheldon F. Best, Harian Harry, Peter Sheridan, Roy Nat, Robert Nelson, Irving Zeller, Louis Habe, and David Sayer. Its concept included easier entry of equation into a computer, an idea developed by J. Halcom Laning and demonstrated in the Laning and Zeller systems of 1952. A draft specification for the IBM mathematical formula translating system was completed by November 1954. The first manual for Fortran appeared in October 1956, with the first Fortran compiler delivered in April 1957. This was the first optimizing compiler because customers were reluctant to use While the community was skeptical that this new method could possibly outperform hand coding, it reduced the number of programming statements necessary to operate a machine by a factor of 20 and quickly gained acceptance. Jan Bacchus said during a 1979 interview with Think, the IBM employee magazine, much of my work has come being lazy. I didn't like writing programs, and so when I was working in the IBM 701, writing programs for computing missile trajectories, I started to work on programming systems to make it easier to write programs. The language was widely adopted by scientists for writing numerically intensive programs, which encouraged compilers writers to produce compilers that could generate faster and more efficient code. The inclusion of a complex number data type in the language made Fortran specially suited to a technical application such as electrical engineering. 